to make sure you had access to that. Let's go on this trip with Jay. So you know he's a pilot, if you don't know that, he is, he's a pilot. He will take huh, a camel, he will take an ATV, he will do whatever he needs to do to go to the rough. Here is, where are you in Australia there? Th this is Australia, yeah. That's going down, I'm down that's, that's what I'm talking about. Going down into a, a mine, that, that's, a, that's in Tucson actually, we're going to a, an old gold mine back there. Yeah, <laughs> look at that. Ooh, that's more Tucson right beautiful, there. Beautiful, that's a new material. You're gonna be seeing that in January. Isn't that great? Whoa. ATV, we had, you know, we had a lot of times. But it's just like, uh, now I'm not flying the helicopter there. The plane, um, that, that's Whoa. not my plane. That's a, that's a, rental, a rental plane in okay. Australia. A lot of these countries I go to, I fly myself in my plane, um, North America, you know, is some places, you know, Mexico, places like that, uh, Canada, all that. I, you know, I'll, I'll fly my plane. Um, uh, but when we go to a lot of these countries, especially like Australia, you, you have to you have to get a plane or a helicopter to get around. If you yeah. don't, you you can get there uh, if you you know if by four wheel drive, it'll take you forever. You're going to spend a month, you know, Just, you, you can spend a week going from place to place. Right. But that plane is a perfect example of all the stories I could tell. That plane I rented, that plane, right? We were in it, we we're flying in it, I'm flying it. But when, it, when, I, when I went around and, and did my, my pre-flight on it, the, the back window in that plane was duct taped in. Oh my gosh. <laughs> duct taped in. <laughs> this makes me this crazy. This is a bush plane, okay. But you can get away with that. Out in the Australian push. I mean, you never get away with that. We're just glad you're okay. In America. Okay. But, but you know, the thing is, you, you just you just don't say anything because you just. But if it blows out, it's not pressurized. You don't care. I mean, you know. Okay. But but that's the kind of stuff that I run into all the time. Sometimes. Or something's wired together. Like you, you, they'll have a strut and they'll have bob wire or bailing wire wrapped around, around it. They're <laughs> like, okay, everything's fine. We'll make it. Yeah, <laughs> like yeah. I said, we're glad. Ah, we're glad you're it. okay. <laughs> <laughs> we have something. The world is a landing a landing yeah. area. That's that's right. Uh, this is um, this is something that we've never had before on HSN. I can't tell you how rare this material is. And it's a pendant or drop earrings. It's sixty nine dollars. The pendant is ninety nine. We're going in close. This is a very limited buy. There are two hundred and twenty of the necklaces, and the earrings are ninety two available. And would you please pronounce this for me? Okay, this is astrophyllite, or they, astrophyllite. they get all, they, uh, astrophyllite, or they call it astrophyllite. I mean, you know, okay. it, it, potato, potato, tomato, tomato. I mean, it's something. But if you if you want something that's highly collectible, um, that I'm just telling you, this is really rare. I, I've seen it once in Canada. This particular material uh, I got from um, the miner who gets me our sharite and our seraphonite, and, um, and it, it's. This is from Whoa. Russia. I want to show you that. Okay, Russian? This is Russian, but oh see, my gosh, show the, that. Okay. Oh. So I brought a piece is of the rough to see this. No. It's, is that gold? It, yeah, it's um, it, it's metal. It's metallic. It, it, you know, look it's at that. And it, it's red. If you look at it, you can't really. Oh. We're getting washed out there. But see, okay, so they're perfect. That's perfect. See how she's moving that? And that's look it that. contained within the matrix in, within the. Uh, the mother material is is what you get, and then you get these beautiful, like uh, golden red crystals that grow within this. Um, this is a, a really expensive, expensive material. Um, it it's very, very, very hard to actually uh, to get any kind of quantity on it. You waste so much of this material. You get probably when you cut this, like each of these calves that you're seeing with the earrings and, and the here, cabin that ring. Neck. You're, we get less yeah. than a 5% yield. Really? Less than 5% because you have to cut away so much of the host rock to actually get pieces that have the, um, the, the, the red pyrite that's growing uh, oh. with, with inside of it. Whoa. Isn't that gorgeous? You yeah. see it sparkle right here? Yeah. It's just really, but you know, just like on that, think about this. See, I can only use this section right there. Do you right. see? Right. Yeah, so you, you cut a lot of this material. If you want something that's highly collectible, you, something that's unique and different, um, you're not gonna see uh, everywhere. And the only only place that you would ever normally see this is somebody who is a gemstone cutter. They get this material, they make custom pieces. If you go to the Tucson Gem Show, which is the largest gem show in the entire world, right? It's in February in the United States, in, uh, in Tucson. Um, they have people from all over the world that come. You'll see custom cut cabochons of these that are $100, $300, $400. You'll see custom cut. There's no two, um, you know, they're just doing free form. 
With ours, we had to cut, it's a little harder for us because we're making, even though we're only making a few hundred of these, we still have to match them up best we can. And so we waste even more material than the freeform cutters. But I'm just telling you, if you go, you'll see this. Now also, with the pendant, the chains included. Yeah, and $99. Okay, it's for $99, included. you're getting the, the chain and the pendant. And if you look at this, this is three, actually three sterling silver uh, chains put together. Now, I don't make the chain. It, a friend of ours uh, in Italy actually builds the chain for us because we're not, you know, we're not chain manufacturers. But we started, we didn't really, we attempted to put this on different things and we just thought that this was so classic and so unique and so different. But it's just a beautiful, amazing, amazing material. And I, I gotta tell you, it's extremely rare, very, very hard to come by. Okay, they're going fast too, and now fewer than 200. And we have about that many people who are, who are going, oh, wait, what? Can you pronounce it again for me, Jay? Astro, okay, you can, uh, yeah. astrophyllite, or, you can, or they'll, astrophyllite. They, a lot of people call it astrophyllite, but astrophyllite is how I it's pronounce it. It's literally how it's spelled. That's, well, like that's, you how, just, that's how I, I say it, yeah. Phyllite or affiliate? Phyllite. Phyllite. Astrophyllite, I've heard it, people say it's astrophyllite. I, astrophyllite is, is what is, I call it. Okay. And that's the natural that, material. That here's the and that's natural why I brought material. the rough for you. I'm so glad you did. I love seeing this. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Mother Nature is so amazing. Look at that. So if you, I'm just covering the jewelry, sorry. But I definitely wanted you to see that up close and personal. A lot of silver here. The necklace um, with those multiple chains, all in sterling silver. We're going to go close up. I love the texture that's also surrounding the design, the, the design there, too. Well, if you on look the at, L shape. Okay, if you look at this, too, um, these are all custom made. Uh, you know, all of the, in this case, the uh, cabochons are cut first. And then this, the silversmith is given the cabochon and they custom build every one of these silver designs are custom built just for that particular cabochon. Okay, 087-556. These are going to be gone shortly. There are a couple of things that I did want to just mention to you on hsn.com because we do have some of the astrophiliate. Oh, look at that ring, Jay, right there on a sale too. These are, this is like a different color. It's a right? different color and it, uh, it comes out of Russia. It's a different vendor and it's a different look. How yeah. interesting. Yeah, and it, it's, it's a, a, a different, totally different, um, totally different deposit. Isn't that wild? It is it's wild. It's so wild. And, but I'm just telling you, even on this, you know, it's not like you, uh, like you, you. Uh, Haven't seen that in any local jewelry store. Yeah. I'm not sure if that's astrophilite. It looks like sugalite. I, I think that that's lipidolite, guys. Oh. Oh. Okay. All right. Yeah. I'll have to double check on that. Uh, I, looking at that, um, yeah. yeah, I 